Good morning, folks. Um, thanks for joining me. Today I'm going to be opening this unopened box of 1989 Fleer packs. Um, I got these at a garage sale back in 2016. Um, I've been saving them for a rainy day. I'm going to turn the camera. And I did already open one pack that you'll see. And I didn't find anybody. But at the end of that pack, I actually found this Alvin Davis card. And I talked about the Mariners for a second in a previous video I started to film. Well, then I reached into my back into my box of Fleer packs and I found this card that I've been looking for for years wedged uh, in the box like that. And so I'm very happy that I found this 89 Griffey rookie that I've been looking for. Um, but without further ado, let's see what we can get. I think there's 32 packs in here. There was a lot of good cards in this set, including the Griffey. Bombs, 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 bombs. Great card stock here, really sticking together. A lot of people like to wear gloves to look at the cards, and it's just like, oh, come on, man. Anything good that I find, I'm going to immediately put into a penny sleeve and then into a hard plastic. Um, that was a pack of bombs, folks. <clears throat> Tigers. I was always an Angels fan. Ooh, I got him again. Yippee. Growing up, I was an Angels fan. Um, was born in California. But lived in Washington State for most of my life. So I kind of root for the Mariners now if I root at, for baseball at all. More bums. <clears throat> I'm more of a football guy, but more college lately because I'm feel I feel like the NFL is manipulated, you know. Plus, I'm a Raider fan, so I'm always getting screwed. <clears throat> and we have gotten absolutely nobody. Worth mentioning at this point. I mean, Andy Vance, like, he was obviously a good player, but. <sighs> Bobby Thigpen. <clears throat> Pigpen from Charlie Brown. I think I'd rather have Pigpen's card than Thigpen. Ellis Burks, great player. Used to love Ellis, Burks, Wade Boggs, Mike Greenwell. Another old classic Mariner. You know, when are the Mariners going to win the title? Win the pennant? That would be cool. <sighs> Mike Marshall, Terry Kennedy, Glenn Davis, Mike Maddox, Ruben Sierra. He was always a good little slugger. <clears throat> Tim Belcher. What if your last name was Belcher? <sighs> Horrible cards. Horrible cards. <clears throat> Louis Medina in the heart of Serafina. Keith Gerhardt. Jim Aducci, Luis Aquino, Julio Franco, Barry Larkin, I always liked him, but I got like 1,700 of his cards, Andre Dawson, always liked him, 
Chuck Finley is an old Angel fan. I always liked him. Man, if I was a kid back in 1989 right now, I'd most likely be devastated. So far, four or five packs into this box. Get back to it. <clears throat> Got him, got him, need him, need him, got him, got him. Mark Langston. I'd rather see Tony Braxton than Mark Langston at this point. Uh, Don Robinson, Dave Burr, Oral. Oral, that's a good little card there, Oral. Always practice good oral health, folks. <laughs> and it's accuracy. You know, there's certain players... If you're a card collector, Dennis Eckersley, Kevin Seltzer, Gary Gaetti, Ken Caminiti. You're like, it's like they put two, two duplicate cards of those guys in every pack, you know. Must have a thousand Gary Gaettis in my collection. Sandy Alomar Jr., I'll keep that card. Beautiful card. Gino Petrali. Oh, is this my cousin Pasquale or what? I'll see Virgil. Cool little card. The Dave Clark 5? What? <laughs> Griffy, can you hear me? Griffy, can you hear me? Dear Griffy, are you in my future? Griffy, Kenneth Griffy, Steve Bouchel. Will Clark, Rockwell Matt, mm, Gary Carter, Paul Le Miserabala, <laughs> Tom Gordon, Keith Miller, Brooke Jacoby, Jose Arrejo. Man. I haven't seen this many bums since I went down to downtown Seattle last week. Oh, love you, Seattle. I live more in like the Tacoma area. Roberto Alomar. Brian Houghton. Who? Curtis Wilkerson. I just like his name, you know. It's a cool sports name. Kind of like Brett Saberhagen. Man, I can't even get like a decent guy, like a freaking Conseco or something. Barry Bonds, maybe. <clears throat> Gerald Perry was a good player. Daryl Straubs. I'll take a Straub. Ooh. Ooh. Now we're talking, baby. Now we're talking. <sighs> Kevin Altzer. Get rid of that Greg Maddox. Doug Jones. Jeff Treadway. Dave Gallagher. Chris Spear. Spike Owen. Have you seen that new Spike Owen movie? Yeah, it's a great it's a great movie. Oh, that's Spike Lee. Oh. Oh. I saw Spike Lee. Ooh, there's my sticker. There's my sticker. <clears throat> We're getting hot. We're heating up. Craig Bezio, good little card there. Johnny Ray. Eric plunk you with a 98 mile an hour fastball junior ortiz mike greenwell mikey g dave lapont jay buner the bone he's big in my neighborhood I need that Griffey in my future, Griffey. 
Can you hear me? Come, come again, dear Ken Griffey. I want to know my future. Will you give me a Griffey? Or just Pat Tabler? Come, come again. You know, these actually were kind of pretty cards to look at. I really like the, uh, the Astros. Willie Clark. Jim Presley Bum Mariner. <clears throat> I could use a stick of bubble gum right now. That'd be nice. Steve Jeltz. Jeff Musselman. I just got this Will Clark stupid card. Gary Reedus. Vince Coleman. Oh, I feel like there's a card stuck together there. There is, so I will put these down. <sighs> Presley again from the Mariners. Bums, I tell you. Bums. Mickey Brantley. Guillermo Hernandez. Mike Sosha. Mikey Scott. Craig Dickey Thon. Bum, 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 bum. That's a cool little card. A cool little card. Ron Tingley. Oh, we are about, I think, halfway through, folks. Claudel Washington, Paul Kilgus, Al Hall, like father, like son. Sandy and Roberto Alomar, Don Gordon, Lenny Dykstra, Michael McFarlane, Mookie Wilson, Willie Upshaw. Thanks, but no thanks. The Sox are going to win the pennant. Look at this. Oh, okay. Jose Batista. Frank Tofino. Chet Lemon. Lance Folters. Joe Giardi. Rolling Rooms. Oh, Mike Davis, Cecilio Guante, Cecilio Guante, Dennis Martinez, Mark Kubzika, Chris Brown, John Candelario. No thank you, 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 no thank you. No thank you. Oh man. Santana, Larry Anderson, <sighs> Wally Joyner, used to be a fan, Fred McGriff, good little card. Doug Brayback, Don Glad. Well, they really came from the factory upside down. Mike Schooler. Every time I see that Mariners logo, I'm thinking Griffey. I'm lazy when I open cards. I know guys that flip every card right side up. Sometimes I look at them backwards. Especially like a Bowman card. 
I just read the name off the back like this. I'm going to do this pack like that. Greg Brock, Damon Berryhill, Mike No Name, Sean Hillegas, Jose Rijo, Brooke Jacoby, Keith Miller, Tom Flash Gordon, I just dropped you, Rick Shu, Gary Carter, Carmen Castillo, Kurt Ford, Batman. These are not the most desirable cards, folks. Um, trying to find where I dropped Tom Gordon, but we'll look for him later. He will survive. He will survive. Well, it's Chris Sabo, man. If you had a penny for every Chris Sabo card you've ever had, you'd probably be rich. <clears throat> Steve Curry, Sean Dunstan, Paul Malter, Al Newman, Jody Davis. I mean, what a great day this would be. Benito Santiago. Now, my buddy is a big Benito Santiago fan. He was a catcher himself, so he, he claims Benny Santiago is the greatest catcher to ever play the game. I don't know if I quite agree with that, but I save him any Benny Santiago card. Look at the cut on this card, on the Bobby Witt. I mean, they nearly cut his name off. I'm wondering if this is possibly some kind of error. It's horrible card horrible card i'm gonna save that card just to look at again because that's pretty weird <clears throat> mariners lenny dykstra don gordon jim traber tom filer Craig Leifertz, Oil Cam Boyd, Ryan Sandberg. I like this card. BJ Surhoff. I mean, God, never been a fan. These cards are everywhere. As a player, you know, he's good. I'm just saying, when I see him in my cards, I just get disgusted. There's just certain players, Brett Saberhagen's. Like, I don't ever want to see your card again unless it's, like, a very rare rookie. In fact, I don't even really want to see 1989, 80, 90, 91 cards again. I, want only, I only want to look at stuff 87 or older at this point. Or if it is newer, I want it to be football or basketball cards. Uh... Or baseball cards. I just am kind of sick of this junk wax era. But there's a lot of players. Whose card I would like to get today. I'd like to get like a Tom Brady. You know. Even some of the newer baseball players. I'd like to get a couple Mike Trout cards. Horrible cards. Looks like we have nine packs left. Save that sticker for my friend Jake. He's a big... Look at this Randy Johnson card. And again, it looks like the top is chopped off. The big unit. Um, I don't know if they all look like that. Or this is an error. This is more valuable, less valuable. But I'll definitely save that card. Interesting. A little fine. Oh! There it is. Praise Jesus. Praise, praise, praise. Beautiful Jesus. Save this Kirby Puckett. <clears throat> Unbelievable. You know, that's why we do it, folks. This is why we collect these cards. Randy Johnson, Ken Griffey Jr. in the same pack. I mean... This has been a very strange day, especially with finding my 89 Upper Deck Griffey card. God, that was beautiful finding that Griffey right there. It really makes you feel like you're a child. 
again, I remember collecting cards with my father. I was born in 79. So by 19, you know, 86, 87, I was looking at cards with the neighborhood kids. By 88, 89, me and my dad were collecting. Of course, I was only 10 years old at the time, so my dad was buying all the cards. But every Friday, he would get paid. And he would stop off on the way home, and he'd bring home either a box, like we're opening now, of 32 packs or uh he'd bring home like the tops i remember he brought home the tops traded 89 rookies he brought home the uh or tops traded 89 and then he brought home the don russ rookies and i'd get sets for christmas but you'd be surprised at how many cards me and my dad here's another one david wells with the bad cut uh, you'd be surprised how many sets me and my dad actually collected just doing it the old-fashioned way marking off the checklists going through packs of cards pack after pack i don't remember my back hurting as much uh, when i used to sit here and open cards maybe it's because i'm leaning over for the camera we now have six packs left well, we will after this pack. I'll try to get through them quicker for you folks. In all reality, the climax of the video already happened. Ooh, there's a Gary Sheffield. We will definitely put that in some hard plastic. But yeah, finding the Griffey. I mean, that's why you film a video like this. You hope and pray to find the Griffey. You see how it was on the very back card too? I saw that it said Mariners just sticking out a little bit. So, hopefully that was on camera pretty good because it was just stuck to the back. It's almost like they put it as the last card on purpose. You know, do you think they... Ooh, and there it is. It's turning out to be an okay box, folks. In fact, it's turning out to be an outstanding box. We've got Cal Ripken Jr. we got Griffey. Now, you know, if that's the only card you get, is the Griffey and a little Ozzy Smith? We'll take that. Wade Boggs, we'll take that. I mean, if you can get a Griffey, you did your job. And you know this Griffey is meant. You just gotta be careful putting it into the putting it into the plastic. And you got yourself a mint, brand new Griffey. If any of you guys see cards that I might be passing up, please like, uh, comment, let me know. Because I dig through cards. I mean, we are down to our last four packs of the 1989 Logo Stickers and Trading Cards box. And this time we get the Minnesota Twins. I just dropped Vince Coleman. I wonder if he's down there with Flash Gordon, who I dropped earlier. Brady Anderson. You know what? What if we got the fuck face? Billy Ripken. I believe that's in this, this pack as well. Now that would be awesome. Uh, three more packs, folks. Again, we've already done our job with the beautiful, sweaty Ken Griffey Jr. rookie card. Three packs left. Rex Hudler. I'm just trying to get the sticker. Here we go. Mike Esaski. Rex Hudler. Mario Diaz. Scott Geralt. Steve Searcy, Tim Leary, Oswaldo Parazza, Bob Nepper, Jeff Pico, DeGallo, Roberto Kelly. I just like the look of that Roberto Kelly card. I think I'm going to put that in hard plastic. Sometimes I either just collect cards that, you know, there's Tom Glavin. This card's uh, worth some money, I believe. And here's a Maguire Conseco. 
which we will happily take. Two cards left. Two packs left. Like I was saying, sometimes I'll put a card in hard plastic, even if it's virtually worthless. But it's, uh, I like to collect a lot of the Seattle players. Um, in fact, uh, I'm not sure about this card. This McGuire's brother or something. I like the look out of it, look of it. But sometimes just if I like the look of a card or it's a sentimental player to me, like an Al Davis, for example, growing up in Washington State. Or I'm a big Raider fan if it's like a Chester McLaughlin card. Or, you know, not a premier player, but to me, uh, you know. We are down to our last pack of cards in the 1989 logo stickers and trading cards full box. I believe 32 wax packs. Here we go. Last pack. Last pack, Mike Scott, Greg, I don't even know, Ken Phelps, Mitch Williams, Dion James, I prefer a Dion Sanders, I don't even know if he was in the league at that point, but Daryl Strawberry, Will Clark, and here's our last few cards, Ron Tingley, Kevin Reynolds, Jose Batista, Don Augusto, Jerry Gleaton. So, we also got the Oral Hershiser, folks. Let's not forget about that. Um, this is what I kept out of this case. Tom Glavin, I'm going to put that down with my Griffey, with Little Kelly, Wade Boggs, Ozzy Smith. We got the very well. All in all, the Gary Sheffield. I mean, really, you guys. What an excellent box of cards. Uh, the Ryan Sandberg. I really cannot complain. Kirby Puckett. Randy Johnson. I don't like that they cut off his, his name like that at all. Mm. Benito Santiago from my homeboy. Gary Carter, the Alomar brothers, Strawberry again, Mickey Brantley, Buner, Craig Biggio, Ripken. I mean, come on. Daryl Strawberry. We actually did very, very well. And let us not forget Oral Hershiser. Let us not forget what we all came here for. That was the Ken Griffey Jr. card. We got it, folks. We came, we saw, we kicked their ass. Join in next week or next month, next year. I don't know. I film videos randomly. I mean, take a look at this. As you can see, I'm inspired right now. I have all my best cards. Plastic up. Shout out to the late, great Junior Seau. Here's the travesty and the destruction of what we just did. And here in my hand, the Ken Griffey Jr., which will come over here to the bar where we will most likely pour a drink and put her in hard plastic. Thanks for joining me, guys. Have a great day.